today, it's a little bit wet outside, but we run a football program for multicultural kids and refugees. I actually had to ask them to come out of the rain to come in today. And the Wellington Phoenix have um, joined us today, which is amazing. So we've got four players from the Wellington Phoenix here. They're giving away some gear and signing some autographs for our players. Lou <laughs> Fenton. There you go. Yeah, this one as well. Didn't you get black and yellow? I see one of these kids, so, and then now he, and then um, them looking at me, it's, yeah, it's crazy experience, to be honest. I'm from the Congo, so if some of you probably know it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one year in Australia? Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Damn. Damn, that's, his English is better than me by that time. Really good. Yeah. I, it took me a year and a half to learn English. It was like, it was an amazing country, but then I'm like, if I can't speak the language, then I can't really fit in. So I found a way of football, straight away joined football, and I found it a lot easier. And I started talking to mates, just football languages as well, but then when you get off the park, and then everyone's speaking English, and they're making you, you know, understanding the game in English as well. So I, I quite learned English easier, to be honest, and why I started playing football. I told them, well, I went through it, you're gonna get through as well, so it's obviously, and Australia's a great country to be honest, and more culture, so I told them, you'll be all right, because if I can make it, you guys can make it as well. The idea was that um, a lot of refugees wanted to play football, but weren't sure how to get into it. So we started the program off with Football South Coast here at the Fraternity Club. The kids came down and had a kick. Um, in the last two years, we've transferred that into more community engagement, and the idea is that they come down, have a kick with us, and then I sign them up to clubs in the area and then they go on to play football for clubs in the area. Yeah, this is maybe size 8 or 9 I think. This is good. It's be... Clayton's one. I saw you play. I, yeah. I like how you play. Well, Thank you, my friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Seven. Perfect. Yes. Appreciate it. Opposition. Uh, no, seven, I three. play a right wing or right back. Right. I was born in Iraq but raised in Syria. Um, came to Australia when I was 10 years old. And um, I, well, I love playing soccer, and so I've heard about NCCI going through this program every week when I was school. So I grabbed friends and I came every week to play. It was an honor to actually meet them in person, hear a little bit about them, and how I can actually be a, um, a professional player when I'm older and take them as role models to get there as well. The city and the people from here are like trying to make us feeling home, you know, they are supporting us on the best way. They come to the game, so it's nice to try to give something back to the community here, here in Wollongong. So, yeah, we enjoy with the kids and we are happy to be here. Better if the weather is nice and we can go out, but no, we saw the kids, they want to play, they want to enjoy. And when you have a ball, you just want to, to play and kick, no? Here we go, here we go. Don't drop it, don't drop it. Oh, here we go. He's trying to trick me, huh? Hey. Ah! <laughs>